All right, first station. You got your hips up, but not overextended, meaning in line with your shoulders. And you're just doing what Holly's doing. Very simple. They're passing each other, but notice their hips aren't dropping down. That's their first 30 seconds. Don't let your hips drop. Okay. In the second 30 seconds, you come up on your hands, fingers facing forward. Finish it off with a longer range of motion, lengthening those muscles, getting some good try work at the same time. All right, second station. You got the kettlebell resting on the back of your forearm. Notice she's sliding down with her hand on her leg as she looks up at the kettlebell, hinging forward slightly so you can clear your hip. Getting a lot of mobility, flexibility, deep core stabilization, and switching it up. Okay. Don't worry, we'll be here to really work with you on these if you're looking a little confused at this exercise. All right, third station. You're going to undulate the ropes. She's got a little squat going on. Notice the ropes are nice, even wavelengths. She's not slinging them all around crazy. Show them the wrong way. Yeah. All right, that's pretty good. All right, halfway through, 30 seconds in, just switch to double undulations. Again, nice wave amplitude all the way through. They should be even in height, just like Holly. Still staying in that squat. Weight over your heels. All right, with the suspension trainer, sun's out, time to get the guns out. She's on the BOSU, so she can really lean back and really putting that weight in there. Also using her core at the same time, elbows are high, pulling those palms right towards her face, okay? Second 30 seconds, you're gonna switch to a rotational exercise. With your feet on the ground, get some good rotation, get some good resistance on there, meaning resist with the other hand and you'll feel it more in your core. All right, on the bag, you got a couple of five-pound dumbbells, and you're going to give that bag hell and a good, nice little squat, core tight. Punch it out. Burn it out. 30 seconds in, you're going to switch to the roundhouse kick, keeping the dumbbells in your hand. Notice how she's keeping the dumbbells up in the air as she kicks with the instep right where your shoelaces are hard as she can. 